It may be necessary to set up more than one zone in order for your robo mode to work effectively over the entire lawn. Having two or even three zones does not affect the efficiency of the robo mode. Where grass areas are not contiguous or are separated by fences or other objects, it is also recommended to make each of these a separate zone. The key is to set up the zones that will allow Robomo to operate with the greatest efficiency in multiple zone lawns. Typical three plot setup solution. Locate the base station in the backyard and wire all around the three zones as one loop. Robomo will take care of the base zone automatically using the weekly program. To mow the front zones, simply take Robomo to the desired zone and press the green Go button on your Robomo. Wires leading to the next plot are parallel and touching. The gap between them is for illustration only. Another option for this very same lawn is to have two separate loops. First, locate the base station and wire the backyard as your base zone. The front zones will be operated using a perimeter switch. You may purchase it as an accessory. Mount the perimeter switch on a wall or on its stake, making sure it is vertical to the ground. If there is no physical barrier between the back and front yard or part of the front yard and the path is wide enough for Robomo to move freely from one to another, the front yard may be included in the base zone. The entire base zone will automatically be mowed on the days and times you schedule. Zone B is looped separately and the perimeter wire will be activated using the perimeter switch. If there is a narrow pass of less than one meter, three feet, between plots, it is suggested to set the wire as shown. This will reduce the chance that Robomo will cross between plots while mowing the inner area of one of them. To transport between plots, take Robomo away from the base station, turn the main switch off and carry it to the desired plot. For easy transport, you may purchase a remote control offered as an accessory.